Welcome back to Energy and Cleaning. Today I'm gonna be sharing with you 10 useful things if you have a dishwasher you are gonna wanna know and you all. I got so many videos on this channel on dishwasher tabs. I should buy stock in the dishwasher tab industry. And number 10, number 10 is my favorite because you know it's a time saver. This channel is all about cleaning hacks, tips, and tricks if you are brand new here, so let's jump into it. Don't mind the dirty dishes in the sink here. I had to clean it out for this video. I want you to do something for me right now. Well, you can't do it right now, but pretty soon. I want you to turn on your water and feel when you turn on your water is it immediately hot if yes you are good to go if it is cold when you turn it on here's what you need to be doing you need to run this on hot water before you start your dishwasher because this is attached to this and you don't want cold water moving on into here especially because cold water is not going to help activate these as well it's been a couple months since i checked this down right in here but most dishwashers will have some sort of filter or a trap. You can see mine is right here. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this out and let's just take a peek. You all, last time I did this, it was so disgusting. The filter is not looking too shabby. You can see a little gunk around here. Last time I cleaned this, I don't think it had ever been cleaned. If your dishwasher is not draining properly or it's making funny sounds, this is the first place that I would check. How do you clean this? I just take a little warm water, a cleaning toothbrush, and a little dish soap like this. And even though I just cleaned this a couple months ago, I'm finding stuff like that. All cleaned up, I just popped it back into place and then twist it on. This is a bonus tip right here. This is to ensure that your dishwasher does not overflow. Flow. I need to know right now how many of you are guilty of cleaning your dishes before you put them in the dishwasher I know I've been guilty of this put your dishes in the dishwasher dirty because it's gonna help these cling better to the fats and oils on the food which overall will make your dishes cleaner another question survey says how many of you have actually read what's inside the dispenser right here Hard water, fill to here. If you have soft water, you fill to there. And you have a pre-wash. Now, if you use the tabs, you don't need to worry about this section right here. But technically, if you use something like this, which is what I usually prefer, you gotta fill both. And I'm out. Good thing I have a bunch of packs on hand. Okay, this is totally random, but some of you might appreciate this. I'm obsessed with the smell of this. Like, I could just smell that all day long. How of you have arguments or debates with your significant other or roommate on the proper way to load this baby i know that we are guilty of that in this house in fact i have a video in the description box below on the best way to load your dishwasher so that everything gets cleaned more effectively and more efficiently if you have your owner's manual which by the way i don't know that i've ever seen an owner manual for any dishwasher that i've had the proper way to load it should be in there if you are looking to save some dollars when it comes to running your dishwasher load it at night before you go to bed during non-peak hours and in fact it is also more cost effective to wash your dishes in the dishwasher on a full cycle rather than hand washing an entire lake of dishes right here i know it seems counterintuitive to clean your dishwasher even though this is meant to clean but as you saw in the trap right there a lot of stink and gunk can get caught up in here so what i like to do on a monthly basis is i will just take a little baking soda sprinkle it down here in the bottom of the dishwasher there's no exact amount that you need to be using but that's usually about a good tablespoon and then i like to add a little bit of vinegar right here then go ahead and run your dishwasher on a normal cycle if you don't like this method just take a glass fill it with vinegar and you can also run it that way okay i can't be the only one that this happens to honey are these dishes clean or dirty and you're shaking the dishwasher check and see if like there's any water on top of the cups you're waiting for someone to respond they look clean you think they're clean and then you start taking them out and then your significant other is like hey those aren't clean here's what many people will do is they will have some sort of magnet outside here that will say clean or dirty and then they will flip it up or down just depending upon if the dishes are clean or dirty what we do here in my home and we actually did this growing up is anytime the dishes are clean so you are running your dishwasher you put a folded towel on top of it right here because this lets anyone else in the house know that these dishes in here are clean so anyone feel free to take them out fun fact growing up my job entirely was taking the dishes out of the dishwasher and I despised it mom if you're watching this you know what I'm talking about now as adults I don't mind that much not only are dishwasher tabs used for so many amazing things but this dishwasher in and of itself you can put so much in here to be washed in fact i made an entire video about washing your vents i also clean my bissell vacuum cleaner parts in here it just makes the job much 
easier. Pretty much anything you can put in a washing machine, you can put in a dishwasher. No joke, I took all the vents out of my house when I was filming a video on dust-free hacks and put them in my dishwasher. If I had to have hand wash those and dry them, it would have taken me hours. If you enjoyed this video, make sure that you give it a thumbs up so that I can reach more people. Share this out to Facebook and Pinterest. Sign up for the weekly newsletter, which is all things cleaning hacks, tips, and tricks. And I will see you, my friend, in the next one.